Welcome, everybody, to a brand new episode of Here's a Scenario, your new favorite podcast by The Metrics. I'm one of your hosts, Mike Cannon. With me, as always, is Mike Feeney and also Brendan Sagalo. And boy, do we have a fantastic guest, a returning guest, if you've watched our live episode from this past year's Skankfest. A fan favorite. A Which fan favorite. No, you have. You've a, watched it. A festival darling, may I say. Oh, breakout, yeah. breakout performance. You were one of the, the names reverberating through the halls of old Vegas. <laughs> Sam Talent, everybody. Festival darling at Skankfest. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I want to back in. <laughs> All those people nodding off on ketamine. Yeah. The Vegas uh, you're one. our favorite. <laughs> yeah. So like, you're just the biggest one. <laughs> we remember you. Everyone else could have been a hallucination but yeah <laughs> i was reverberating as my footsteps <laughs> yeah. yeah well welcome to town man boys it's, it's very awesome. glad to be here thank uh, you for having me awesome to have you you've been uh you've been doing the rounds going, yeah you're on a podcast on tour what are you are you promoting something i'm just in new york <laughs> <laughs> yeah i'm just here until thursday headlining union hall and i was nice. like well i gotta make hay sure i have the hay's i've been made into hay i'm a scarecrow now. yeah <laughs> <laughs> the birds are eating my eyes man <laughs> i've done three podcasts a day for the last three days oh that's <laughs> yeah. terrible Jeez. it's great i'm really i'm grateful that people will have me but well yeah. you know you don't gotta be here man Okay. <laughs> no, no, Get no, the no, fuck out of here. That was how Brendan <laughs> took that, apparently. Yeah. Well, I'll take everything in defense. <laughs> Which is my problem. I feel like Slurms uh, from uh, Futurama. Futurama. Yeah. yeah. Just, like watch a movie in order of pizza, man. <laughs> At that, any, by the way, any, yeah. any Futurama <laughs> reference is going to rush with Brendan. Yeah. He is, yeah. He is, yeah. He's one of the biggest Futurama fans you will yeah, ever meet. Yeah, dude, that episode especially is so funny. It's great. Oompa loompa decrety didiant. Yeah. You will never know the secret ingredient. That's right. All right. I, 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 you pointed at Sam, and he just went, "That's right. Yeah, yeah. yeah. that is how it happened in did, the show." Yeah. Did you want me to do the worm? <laughs> no, I don't know. What reaction were you expecting? I don't know. I thought we would a little pop. And well, lock you know what happened. Nice. What had happened was I uh, started doing it, and I went, "This isn't going to pay off." But I can't go umpa. You know what? Never mind. No, you were. I would have crushed. I would have crushed. You know what? That, that would have crushed. Fuck, dude. That oh. was similar to my uh, TikTok. Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! 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 Yeah, you got moment it. Moment where I found myself deep in the sing song of that, and yeah. apparently I was eight years late to that trend, uh -huh. and also just in the middle of it. And boy, did it not. Yeah, go over he well did the first. Oh no! And we were like, we get the reference, but then he was he like, let me let it. me hammer at this home, yeah. Yeah. like yeah. Cartman needing to sing "Come Sail Away" in its entirety every time he hears it. <laughs> More references. Yeah. What is it like? Yeah. yeah. What's it like? Uh, uh, come to the wake. Come to the wake. Come to the wake. Well, I'm just like doing it. Like, uh, all right. Before we get to the questions, I don't know what's happening. It sucks to being a court. fat kid in Colorado because of Cartman. Oh, oh my God. yeah. Uh, Especially if you wore a beanie. Yeah. Yeah. Or a beanies involved. Yeah. Red jackets were out. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. And also, my mom was turning all those tricks with the black <laughs> yeah. shit. Yeah. That didn't help at all. My friend was Jewish. The other one didn't have a tongue, so he sounded like Kenny. Yeah. You ever see those pictures of Cartman's mom in Playboy? Have you mm -hmm. ever seen those? Mm -hmm. They like they like put her in Playboy and it's what? like kinda hot. She's got like pubes and stuff. Yeah, Nicole, does. we're Nicole, gonna need you to bring yeah, yeah. that up right now. Pull those up. Oh. Every once in a while there will be on the side of what the active pornography that I'm viewing, there will be some sort of flash ad for like Lois from Family Guy. <laughs> By <laughs> Brian. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, Brian gets revenge. Yeah. But Lois always got a fat dumper. Mm -hmm. I mean, is that the best good. we can? Does she have a penis? Is that the best we can do? I mean, in this? that picture, it looks like a penis. Yeah. It looks like a full diaper. Does she have a penis? Oh, because she's a hermaphrodite, right? Oh, also seemingly oh. has a vertical cesarean oh, scar. Oh, yeah. Whoa, this isn't like I remember it at Yeah, all. me neither. <laughs> Brenda was like, it's there's better. something amazing oh, about there's it. There's something yeah. so hot about it. Something uh, that established my entire sexual identity. You know what it was? <laughs> I think when I saw it online, it was covering up the penis part. Yeah. I'm just going to say that. I know. Yeah, that, yeah I know. No. I know I'm like That's self-preservation Yeah, yeah. yeah. So, so I From when Jim gay... Norton Wrote for South Park yeah. <laughs> <laughs> He's the one episode He's, yeah. he's just dry They're like Jim do you have anything He's like I'm almost done <laughs> You know You know what's funny Because I thought You were going to go Down this road But uh, on that When you're talking About like the sidebar On a porn website Or something yeah. like that 
Uh, I find that if there is a video I'm watching that has like a photographer there, you know, the ones where there's the yes. occasional flash. Yeah. It really, really takes me out. Like of a, like, a stand up like clip? Like if, if every, what? What'd you say? A stand up clip? No, no. And we're, we're still on oh, porn. porn. Yeah. Like, you know what I mean? There'll be a porn. All of a sudden in the middle of it, you hear like, and then like the whole light, the whole room oh, flashes. Oh, and if it happens oh. once, you're like, it's lightning, you know, or whatever. You can like hide <laughs> yourself. <yourself. laughs> it's Sexy God interrupting. Lightning. But once yeah. there's like seven of them, you're like, I mean, if yeah. there's no budget to get like a silent shutter or yeah. like a, a well kit lighting or you don't need flash. Right. I can't. Well, I, then your brain starts working and you realize how many guys in like Ocean Pacific t-shirts yeah. are leering over yeah. this bed yeah. trying yeah. to be like, this looks good. We're going to yeah. get rich. Yeah, maybe throw like a dialogue in there and be like, oh, that's my uh, camera. That's my little stepbrother with a camera. Yeah. <laughs> He's watching and jerking off. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I like the lightning. <laughs> Like, oh, yeah. Summertime in Nice. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, they're filming on the shore. Some heat lightning, you know. It yeah. happens. You know? Ooh, they're in, they're in the desert tonight. Yeah, <laughs> maybe there's like maybe they're not paying their electric bill. There's it flickering, oh, you know. Maybe nice. it's a bad connection. Who knows? There's a lot of narratives you could make, but not once you hear that loud shudder, it pretty much eliminates all possibility. I don't want porno that's true to life. Though. No, I don't want electric bill issues. Yeah. I don't want like a futon <laughs> and like a Sean Kemp poster on the wall. Yeah, yeah they, you know, if porn's gonna be bad when it starts them sitting on the edge of like a oh. one of those motel beds oh, with like yeah. those like red paisley sort of yeah. uh, the ones that every, the comforter that every motel six mm, or whatever yeah. has. Where you yeah. go, ah, uh, that whole like. That whole like, what's your name? The second you hear a what's your name, and no like, lav mics, no nothing. Yeah. you're like, hey, what's your name? Yeah, like, I'm out of I, all of that's that. That's gonna sound great in post. <laughs> the interview part is. Uh, it's always some guy with a Baltimore accident. He's like, so Sharice, you gonna show us your boobs? <laughs> <laughs> say accident. Accent. <laughs> I thought it was a Baltimore accident. Yeah. I feel yeah. like is that accent. I know what I you zoned. Meant. I zoned out because I was just picturing what porn I like. Yeah. yeah. I, no porn that I enjoy has cameras or anything like that. I've never really seen the the. How is it get, getting beamed to your computer then by imagination? Well, like it's just one camera pointed at uh, someone who's uh, chained up. <laughs> <laughs> someone who didn't need the forty dollars this bad. Uh, they, yeah. <laughs> yeah, I like the handheld ones to where they like yeah. sometimes get thrown out of frame and there's a kid screaming <laughs> behind a locked door. Yeah. I like that and Chris rocks on the TV. Uh huh. Oh yeah, when you see ones with like the Daily Show on, it's yeah. like, dude, this is the ones I like. There was one with right. Nate Bargatze making the rounds. Yeah, <laughs> uh, uh, Nate Bargatze special, That's cleanest great. comedian in America, and there's just like <laughs> <laughs> happening under his musings. <laughs> his music. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's get into some questions. Before uh, we get into some questions, I want to give a shout out to uh, to our boy Ethan Skullfox. He uh, he just had some pretty intense surgery. He's been wow. a Patreon member for oh, a yeah. long time. We love him, and he's a great guy. And we hope he uh, he's on the mend. Did you confirm that he was actually sick? <laughs> I did. Yeah, he okay. showed me the wound. Not a I can get play. you a wound was picture. Was he getting some sort of dick enhancement kind of thing? Um, you know, or... as of HIPAA, I don't want to necessarily give out. What he's <laughs> yeah. experiencing. Oh, are you his surgeon? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I was in podcast. In <laughs> Mike swore that oath. Yeah, I, did. Yeah. I take it very seriously. Mm -hmm. Uh, but yeah, if you want to submit questions, patreon.com slash scenario pod preference goes to you guys. We have three over 300 hours of backlogged wow. uh, podcasts. We're not doing any new Patreon podcast, but we're putting out a ton of content on our YouTube. And again, that's how you support the show. Can that's you how you early. support us. That's how you get the questions in. Not to mention, there's a whole library of shit for you to watch. Wait, though. you guys just have a Patreon and you don't do an extra episode? Anymore. No. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. We, we had yeah, like two yeah. years. We two well, years and... see, we did a thing where we did it for so long uh -huh. and so few people listened to it yeah. that we're like, all right, new people, catch up and then we'll start again. That's yeah. Fair. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah. 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 We were yeah. doing this thing called burning it at every end, you know, burning the candle at both ends. Yeah. That's the one. Uh, we were. Uh, <laughs> I tried to make my own, you know. I wanted to make. Then why did you say the right yeah. one after? Because I uh, knew that you fucking assholes were gonna say something about listen, it. Listen, just own up to your own mistakes. You're right. Ever. You're right. <laughs> <laughs> Ever. <laughs> No. <laughs> this is a real piranha pit. That's right. Oh, yeah. right. It you, sure is. You come in here and <laughs> that, that's almost testimony. nothing gets done. That should be the that name should of be this one of the show. testimonials. Should be the name of this show. The piranha, piranha pit. pit. Yeah. Much better. Yeah. Much better name it's than like, what we have now. Very like difficult tank. to spell piranha though. <sighs> here we go. All right. First question, Brock. <laughs> oh. Without a K, what were you about to he do? He was going to spell piranha. No. Oh, oh, spell <laughs> yeah. piranha. All right. Here we go with the spelling. 
I don't know how to spell it, by the way, so I don't even know how P. to spell it. <laughs> Easy. So P. far, so good. <laughs> Very good. Yeah. P I yes. Bingo. R. That's right. A. Go to the big board. Yeah. P I R A. N? Correct. Yeah, yeah. yeah it's not a Q. <laughs> this is going to get where it's a little tricky. Uh, yeah, this sure. is where you're unfamiliar with these last two letters. I'm going to throw a fucking wild card here, dude. <laughs> X. <laughs> H- 13. H. A. That's right. N. A. No. No. no! Piranha. <laughs> what? Piranha. <laughs> you Damn fucking it. dolt. Oh, you got it. it right. He said there was only two letters. And left. I got the hard one. <laughs> <laughs> no. What, dude? <laughs> what the fuck? I got the hard one. You spelled a different word. I'll Piranana. never, I'll never <laughs> not enjoy the any guests coming in just reacting to reacting Brendan. To Brendan. It's yeah. Yeah. reaction video. We're going to be like able to make a super cut. I spelled yeah. it like Gwen Stefani was saying it. <laughs> that, um, man, dude, this even, even when piranhas. you're right. piranhas. <laughs> Even when you're right, you're a little wrong. Dude, I can't believe I did that. that. Even in the spelling bee, you went so fast beyond the correct answer that they would have disqualified you. They would have been like, oh, you... You're yeah. still going. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Fuck. Yeah. <laughs> Damn it. That was a real fun thing to witness. <laughs> <laughs> we'll be right back. <laughs> first, uh, uh, all right, first question. Brock without the K. So that's upsetting as well. Mm-hmm. <laughs> sure is. <laughs> Brock. Would you rather fight Mike Tyson or The Undertaker in a last man standing match? Taker. Is yeah. The Undertaker like... Taker. In character? Yeah, is he in character? Is he actually is, hurting you? Yeah, is it a shoot match or kayfabe? Yeah. What do we got Because I, I could take a couple of throws to the ground and like the stuff that actually hurts, but Mike Tyson is knocking So let's say, let's say The Undertaker, sure, in character, but the blows are real. So he's he's Choke allowed. You. Yeah, he's allowed. All, all the all the strikes are like they they cause real damage. Yeah, he's at, he has a real beef with somebody with some fighter or wrestler who like walked by him recently while he was being interviewed at an MMA match, and he literally like stopped the interview, looked at the guy, and goes, "You want to do this right now?" <laughs> and, and the guy stopped and then they walked separate and the interviewer was like uh, what was that and he's like he knows <laughs> so he thing, knows now to add Dude. clarity as well the last man standing match is a very specific set of rules which is a it's essentially an endurance match so it is right. as many as many times you could be like you know whatever pummeled until what pummeled yeah like as many I mean, times you can get pummeled just as though it's it's an endurance. say it one more yeah I, spell pummel I didn't think you would actually spell pummeled p u m m pum e l d e l e d e d God <laughs> Jesus Brendan man. always struggles with e d yeah <laughs> and that's why it's, that's also why I said he's unfamiliar with the last two letters of piranha oh because it's ha uh, that's oh, funny uh, thank you thank you um, <laughs> the boys are so, peppering you up so, so yeah I that's think, what they do. So I think uh, gotta gotta season that steak, you know. They're pummeling me, <laughs> pummeling. Um, I <laughs> I think uh, I I kind of think Tyson, you know, he's he's fast and he's furious, but he's known for gassing out. So I think in a last man standing match, you'd rather go again because Undertaker is known for constantly coming back. Every time you think he's dead, he sits back up. Right. So I think that uh, Tyson. <laughs> that is his thing. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Nobody bring any coffins in here. <laughs> yeah. I will win if there's no coffins. As long as there's not an open grave near the yeah, ring. Just like- <laughs> Dude, I remember that wrestling match as a kid where he like, he like came out of the middle of the <laughs> yeah. ring and like pulled the guy. It was like, Wah! like it was yeah. a crazy. He's scary. Yeah, <laughs> he's the dead man. I yeah. scary. Him and Kane are terrifying. Dude, I remember when I was, I was the first wrestling match I went to at Nassau Coliseum in Long Island. They, you know, when he came out, like literally, all, you know, they turn out every light in the entire the arena, bell. just oh, yeah. pitch black, Pong. and then that, ba- yeah. and it was, it was like a goosebump moment. So I'm going. I'll, I'd rather take Dyson. I never, never. Never underestimate the taker. Dude. But it's last man standing. Any punch from Tyson, I'm no longer standing ever. <laughs> yeah. I've just been reduced yeah. to crippled. Right I'll just then. run. Can you run around the ring? Yeah, yeah. from Tyson? Yeah. Yeah. He's, yeah. Like, <laughs> yeah. He's kinda good at yeah. knowing how to corner. No, he, he yeah. catches pigeons, but he can't right. catch a piglet. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. You're gonna, gonna gas myself up. Tyson. <laughs> <laughs> 
Yeah. There's, well, yeah. you ever hear of David and Goliath? Yeah. That's what I thought. Yeah, that's Next made question. up too. <laughs> I wasn't made up. There are, whoa, whoa, whoa. You know, are you funny vehemently that, uh, defending the Bible right now? <laughs> Brendan's getting angry. As a Christian, yeah. <laughs> no, this is my favorite uh, Brendan, though, is when he's on such a defensive, he'll back any cause oh, sure. no matter yeah, what. Yeah, yeah. I'll like die on every hill. If we say slavery is wrong, he'll yeah. try to put out a, yeah. a, a, an argument well, you for, know. Its, <laughs> for its pros. He's got a lot he of work done. Made the pyramids. <laughs> yeah. And we, everybody loves those. Yeah. It's cool when we enslave those aliens to build the pyramids. Yeah. 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 Way that, to go, Pharaoh. <laughs> <laughs> Did you guys hear row, when, row, row, when, row. He, when he said, uh, Undertaker's scary? <laughs> yeah, we all heard it. Okay. And we all moved past it. <laughs> Dude. You're going to need to get the, uh, you're going to have to feel it around. We don't really go back. That's we do a lot. We We're do a, a side lot. scroller. Yeah. <laughs> We're just kind of like, We're like ca- Mega Man. Catch, catch it as I say it. Yeah. Of thing. Catch it as I say it. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so yeah, I, I agree with the Tyson thing though because it's yeah. As soon as you engage in a fight, your your legs are done. Yeah. You can have, you could probably run away from Undertaker. Even you would have a chance to outrun the uh, Undertaker. Yeah, he yeah, kind of only walks. Yeah. Like he Michael walks Myers. very slowly, like Michael Myers. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, but he always catches up to you, like Michael Myers. That's the thing about like when you watch Halloween, they're running so fast. The only reason they catch up he catches up to them is because they like break their ankle or some shit. Like all you have to do is kind of like lightly jog and you can get away from you could speed Michael walk. Myers. Yeah. yeah. Speed walk. Get yeah. Mm-hmm. Put on a purple windbreaker and just a couple of wrist weights and speed walk away. Yeah. I, I had know. this exact same kind of conversation. I did a, a Quibi show. Nice. Like Quibi. Yeah. Remember yeah. We thought that was the future. <laughs> yeah. They we got sure our hopes did. up for Quibi. <laughs> yeah. It was with Will Smith. And he was like, "Oh, I remember that." Hanging yeah. out with us. Oh yeah. And it was me, Sean Patton, and David Borey were like with Will Smith as he was like <laughs> overlooking the Las Vegas Strip in this like, uh, play. Like, what is it called? A suite. Mm-hmm. And he brought up the question. He was like, "Would you rather get tackled full speed by Ray Lewis, or punched in the head by Mike Tyson?" And he was like, "I think that I'm taking the tackle because I'm wearing a helmet." <laughs> and we were all like. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> Sorry we can't riff on this, Will yeah. Smith, but yes. Yeah. No one wants to get punched by Mike Tyson. In the head. I, I don't need yeah. get tackle me without pads if it means not getting punched in the head by Mike Tyson. Yeah. yeah. He walked it back and he's like, okay, how about punched in the stomach? And I was like, that's where my liver and pancreas are, Will Smith. <laughs> it's very hard to reveal to Will Smith that he has flawed logic, you know? Yeah. Because you're yeah. talking to an idea. It's mm-hmm. not a person. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I just remember like looking at Pat and being like, well, yeah, no shit, Will Smith. <laughs> of course, yeah. you're going to get tackled by Ray Lewis. Yeah, he's also, I wonder if he, because Michael B. Jordan was like quoted saying like, oh, I could probably get in the ring with a couple amateurs and put up a good fight and like okay. whatever. Oh, I, I wonder, he's that. out of his mind. Dude. And I wonder if, if Will Smith trained so hard and has that ego as well, where he's like, oh, I might be able to take like a slip or two from Tyson. Oh, maybe not full he's connect. Ollie. Yeah. I, you know, who knows? Maybe. Well, he was jacked for that. And also he's been famous since he was a teenager. So that also doesn't hurt. You know, if you're, if you have an ego of a, an A-list celebrity yeah. for 40 plus you're, years. Exactly. Hell, a little yeah. warp your worldview yeah <laughs> yeah <laughs> all right next question great question brooke that's right brooke yeah. brooke tanya pass <laughs> next question <laughs> all right he called it carrie potter <laughs> uh, tanya ai robots are at war with humanity you're suspected of being a robot if you had to prove that you're human what would you say well, speaking of Will Smith, that's pretty. Uh, yeah, I would just show them Feeny and be like, "This is a robot. <laughs> yeah. How yeah. could I be?" I would go, "If I'm a man-made robot, then how come my penis is so small? <laughs> <laughs> like, who? If there was someone who could make this, why not make it a big?" One? I see. Yeah, but maybe that's why they made it small. Oh, too much power. That's like, right. Like the statue of David. Yeah. yeah. Right. Yeah. They want everybody to look around the penis. Everybody who's scared the, the statue of David would have too much confidence and then rape the people. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Man, that statue of David does not know how to spell. <laughs> um, I don't know. I don't know you guys well enough, but just watching you bump around. <laughs> It's so fucking fun to me. (laughs) That's a great way to describe what Brendan does. Bump around. Yes. Because it is. It's it's the most endearing part of our show. It is it's it's why we love him. Yeah. He's so fucking funny 
outside of that, yeah. but then add that, and it's like a superpower. It's like watching a baby have its first ba- bite of ice cream. <laughs> not. Yeah, I'm a deaf baby hearing for the first time. Yeah. <laughs> or, or, yeah. Oh, well, that's why I don't have a big penis. <laughs> a crazy noise. Yeah. Thank God it was really loud. <laughs> Thank God I felt it in my teeth. Oh, yeah. good. <laughs> my fillings did rattle. Yeah. Yeah. No, but I think this is an interesting question. So why don't we oh. move back to the question a little bit? <laughs> it's so big of you. <laughs> All right. I, we're having fun making fun of old blue eyes. I'm not making fun of you, dude. I'm sincere in my enjoyment of you solving simple problems. Well, don't lie to me. <laughs> I'm don't not patronize. I'm not being condescending. <laughs> I can't take it. Can't yeah. take it. No, no. I'm having fun. I'm having You're watching. Fun. Them bump around trying to yeah. get yeah, trying to receive our relationship. Okay, like, it's like how, how you're how establishing we, dynamics. Yeah, yeah how, what's our dynamic? Sure, yeah. I, uh, me and being I overjoyed, you being angry. offensive. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> welcome to the show. Yeah. <laughs> it's kind of my dynamic uh, with everybody. That is the whole show <laughs> overjoyed beats defensive. <laughs> yeah, uh, yeah, wow. So, the AI, how would you prove you're not an alien? Feeny, I don't think you could because I, I'm still not very sure you're a human now. Yeah. 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 If you, you're done. Uh, <laughs> Brendan, just ask him to spell Pennsylvania. And yeah. That's no, over. Are, unless you're a stupid robot <laughs> programmed to be a oh, an idiot. One of those small dick retard AIs. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> what would you do, Sam? This maneuver. Uh, oh, nice. But, but you go, but you go boop, boop. Hey, he's a robot. Yeah. yeah. He made boop, boops. Yeah. <laughs> you can do the hand fart thing, right? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Can a robot do this? Yeah. A yeah. robot would short circus if his palms short were this circus. wet. Short yeah. circus. You'd have a short little circus. Yeah. Then yeah. Being <laughs> a robot. Small okay. clowns. Okay. I see it. Yeah. Right. It's not fun, is it? Right? It's not fun. I love that Vern Troyer vehicle. <laughs> <laughs> short circus. <laughs> the short. tent was just a towel. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> or short in time it could be a minute long circus remember when Vern Troyer was just horny on like that celebrity show on real oh life? yeah he was yeah. Dude. so just drunk just ripping around on like an electric stool just like being wasted <laughs> blackout yeah. drunk pissing into ficuses <laughs> long before Harvey Weinstein popularized yeah. it yeah, yeah. what he arc it no, he was he oh, was dude. literally standing on the seat of his rascal <laughs> yeah. or whatever and was like bleary. I mean, his they were like a, an astonishing percentage of his blood was booze. Yeah. Like yeah. they were like, this shouldn't be, you're going to die, all this stuff. And he was just, yeah, fucking ripping around, pissing all uh-huh. over the apartment. It was awesome. Dude, there is that, that scene in Austin Powers to where he, where they like, uh, where uh, Austin Powers just kind of like throws him against a pipe. Yes. And he just like, yeah. Is yeah. yeah. one of the funniest things yeah. of all time because it's just, he's just, it's just such a little, it's like, it's just think, ink, and then just straight yeah. down. It's yeah. very, um, man, it's. I, mean, I love a good fall. I, I mean, the, the fall from in Hot Rod, the da- the woods dance scene, and then he falls down the oh, mountain. Oh, yeah. Pop, it's, pop. it's one of the funniest scenes ever. And at the actual stunt at the end when he inevitably crashes, but the slide at the end, yeah. they just add this little yeah. accent to <laughs> yeah. it where he falls, whatever, and then he just keeps sliding for like 30 or 40 feet. It's just uh, chef's kiss. No one's talking about Hot Rod enough. No, it's an awesome movie. It, it, my yeah. hat. It's this real is my good. hat now. Mm-hmm. Dude, the, the fact that they cut to a scene of Danny McBride just high-fiving two people <laughs> yeah. and then after like 30 <laughs> seconds goes and that's how it's done. Yeah. Dude, that was <laughs> that was unreal. like, that's so funny, man. That was like Danny McBride's breakout I know. movie, yeah. wasn't it? Yeah. That was that was a special moment seeing that guy like for the first time. Special. It was a so, special moment. To prove I was an AI, I would have this conversation in front of them because I'd be like, "There's no way any algorithm could recreate this enthusiasm for Hot Rod." <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I mean, like this yeah. was not written into any kind of Chat GPT situation. <laughs> no one could predict this. Yeah. yeah. Chat GPT, give us a positive assessment of Hot Rod. Yeah. Maybe. No. Your computer explodes. <laughs> yeah. No nerds. Yeah. This is what you do. Right? You jump in the water, okay? Easy peas. If you're a robot, you'll die. But if you're an advanced robot made out of skin and human cells, maybe Silica. you live. Yeah. Ah, oh, my God. Speaking of that, and I guess kind of related. <laughs> Feeney just tears open his stomach <laughs> yeah. to expose yeah. mainframes. <laughs> <laughs> 
Um, <laughs> can I read you guys a uh, a comment that got sent to my email? Uh, gonna hurt me. Oh, okay, good. Big yeah. time. He just uh, he's like, "You're so funny, man. You're the best." Yeah. Anyway, the other two the are stupid. <laughs> yeah, I like, laughed. Hold the show together. I laughed <laughs> so hard because it's like. It's the most anybody I think has ever hated me in a, well, after watching a stand up clip. Nice. And it kind of relates to this, what were the question? Someone goes, I, this is just fantastic. I fucking love and religiously watch stand up, but I do not like this comedian. <laughs> His laugh is creepy and he looks like he's wearing human skin and trying to imitate a human laughing. Oh, <laughs> so and you're like, so you got my, sent to my email, you know, your email to my email. Oh, nice. Yeah, that's cool. How'd they get your email? Oh, well, cause I had the, the comment oh, okay. thing sent to you. Know, I like that. They got your email and wrote it as if you have a secretary. No, yeah. no. I got the notification sent to my, oh, okay. Notification okay. was oh. sent to my email, okay. so I was like, "Oh, this is probably <laughs> that's not someone." Right. That's Dear Joyce, so or whoever mad. runs the desk of Mike Feeney, yeah, <laughs> I, I hate him. I love. I just love the thing of being like, I watch it. I watch stand up religiously. Yeah, but this <laughs> is where this I draw the I line. Cannot stand. Yeah, yeah, it's a bridge not, too far. Yeah, like you offended the person. Yeah. Now yeah. I'm sorry that I wrote that comment, hearing it out loud. You know. Yeah, yeah. I remember you trying to make that joke. Trying to make the joke. Everybody talked ago. over it. Yeah. Next, next question. Harry Potter. <laughs> <laughs> I'm having. We're going to cut that out, or maybe, right, Nicole? <laughs> or, or maybe they did hear it after all. <laughs> you son of Maybe they bitch. talked over it. To you know what? You. I fucking agree with this person. I Because I love podcasting religious. I love my <laughs> friends <laughs> religiously. Dude, I can't believe you went back to the well for that one. <laughs> <laughs> of all the ones. I'm the kind of guy like... that goes back to the well and then gets stuck in the well. And then yells yeah. at other people for going back to the Why well. Why did you. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Why am I down here? <laughs> yeah, you go back to the well and poison it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Carrie Potter. I'm having jaw surgery today. Just everybody we uh, that listens to us is under the knife, so the numbers will be good this week. Carrie, if you didn't uh, suck all those dicks. <laughs> yeah. 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 Carrie. Nice. Got her. Dick. Brendan's rubbing off. Is it me. a girl? Yeah. Yeah. No, no. I'm not you, <laughs> Cannon. <laughs> but I just yeah, did it idiot. Subtly to You're about to unwrap off. your gift after this. It wasn't subtle. <laughs> I'm having jaw surgery today. So which part of your body would you augment with cybernetic enhancements and what would they be? My brain. Hmm. And hmm. you just learned to read? <laughs> yeah, I would get it up to human. <laughs> brain, please press gauge to human understanding. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. No, I'd get it up to dolphin, to be honest. I think dolphins are uh, smarter than humans. Based on what? Their brains are bigger and they look just like ours. They are huge. They're yeah. huge and yeah. they look they look just like ours. There's no way they're two loaves just us. like us. Yeah, yeah, mm -hmm. more loaves. pronounced. But yeah. COVID looks like HIV. Is it the same thing? Could be. We don't know about it. <laughs> Feeny, what do you think? <laughs> <laughs> what would I have altered? What cybernetic? What like if you could get enhancements from an AI. Robotics, whatever. So if you could get uh, the Brendan said his dick. Did you? Or you said no, your brain. I said my uh, brain. He literally just said his brain. Sorry, I gave him another <laughs> gift. <laughs> Is, yeah, so uh, yeah. You both wanted of them. muscles, arms, leg. I would say, wings. No, I would say wings cybernetically. Would if they're going in, I would say to like like blood cells. Yeah. Like get in there, fight any Ooh. sort of active mm -hmm. diseases yeah. starting. That's cool. Never get sick. All that kind of yeah. yeah Black build up circulatory system is my answer for sure. Hell yeah. yeah. Nice. Cool. Easy. That's a good one because that'll take care of your heart your liver i think all of that is that what they're trying to work on with like the nanotechnology that they they've injected in people yeah. and they they like cut out the the mass right i think so they found <laughs> little, a little they found a thing that just like the other day where it was like they were able to detect like cancer like yeah, a, woman's full, breast cancer. a full year or four early, yeah four years four years earlier. prior mm -hmm. wow that's just a dog, right? That's what the dog comes sniff you. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah the, 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 the cat in the hospital that lays on your bed when you're about to die. Yeah. yeah. Uh -huh. <laughs> Get rid of that cat. Everyone would live forever. Yeah. Get that cat out of the, the hospice cat, ward. Cat yeah. out of there. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's the doctor. Yeah. yeah. Oh, shit. The cat's in there? Uh. <laughs> Baby, we're buying a boat. Yeah. The, the cat's been active today. It's very sleepy. Yeah. <laughs> it only goes on beds of people allergic to cats yeah <laughs> um great okay. answer the blood yeah yeah the blood is i mean i think that's it but i think the blood would also help the brain yeah i'll go blood yeah convoy, convoy, on blood. convoy on blood, yeah. Baby. Yeah, convoy, yeah, 
That's what we do when, when that happens. That's yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. I don't know what it means, like convoy still. And yeah, convoy. It's like you're a bunch of trucks going, trucks going, yeah. going together. in the in place. Uh, uh, now yeah. I know. We're yeah. a convoy. That yeah. sounds great. I've been like, driving all night, my head, head on the wheel. Dude, that's the best road song. Yeah, Golden radar Earring? love. Yeah. Oh my god. The but the worst road song is the Golden Earring one with the twelve minute drum solo in it. <laughs> like the radio edit's great. Yeah, yeah. And there's yeah. like a fifteen minute version of that song where it's like, yeah. Bad. I don't well, need that. You know. Yeah. I'm, I'm gonna have to. If you're get driving. That. You, you want to hear that? Yeah, but your hands are already wet on the wheel. Yeah. You've been driving all night. Yeah. Oh really? Mm-hmm. And there's already a voice inside your head that drives. Let's keep going. Not picking up on Tanya. golden earring stuff. <laughs> That's on me. Yeah. <laughs> I was just stoked to hear someone else. <laughs> um, okay, Tanya. Aliens have taken planet Earth and they put humans in zoos. What do you want in your zoo enclosure? That's not bad. That's not a bad one. No, that's finally I, a good question from these just, mouth breathers. <laughs> 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 uh, my favorite moment from the live podcast, and it's just an all-time quote from this show, is what is this, your first day at question school? Yeah, it's fucking good. God damn it. Uh, so what is it? What, if we, what would if we you were in a zoo, zoo or some sort of prison... Right, what would you put in your enclosure? Like, if you had choices, if, it, if aliens were to put us in a zoo enclosure, but design it based on our own needs and wants, what would you have a in A gun and a single bullet. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not doing that time. Yeah. 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 Well, I told That's this story on, uh, on the Alaska travel series that I did with Nicole, but there was a man in the Bronx Zoo. The uh-huh. Bronx Zoo had a human exhibit. What was it? Just like a Chinese guy? Oh, it, was a, it was a pygmy fucking... Uh, yeah, and this is African after, guy, right? after slavery was over. They gave him a bow and arrow so he could hunt his own food in his enclosure. No. And instead... What did he do? He turned and tried to fire it at the people yeah. looking at his fucking what thing. What was this guy's name? Like uh, Tatumbe like, or something? Yeah. Like something, something, something like, that. like that. And I did. I hope that's Ears fun. open. <laughs> yeah. It's pretty close. Yeah. Yeah. Ears open. <laughs> <laughs> Tatumbe. <laughs> Nicole, if it's T- not. Tatumbe let's, Jefferson? Let's yeah. nanotechnology <laughs> that out of this episode. It's definitely not. It's not? <laughs> Damn. But that was Ota him. Otabanga. 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 Not bad. Yeah. Not bad. Oh. <laughs> no. Don't look around like. Not bad, right? Yeah, okay, you got right? It. right, boys? You I'm got safe. it. <laughs> convoy. Convoy. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> the trucks have departed. Uh, yeah, it, was like, it was like Tatuba yeah. in the Crucible. <laughs> now, I I would. That's terrible. I didn't know that story. They, like, he got let out. Like, they let him out. Not only did they let him out, but they let him out with, like, a suit, a briefcase, nothing. and no, yeah. no, like, how to make it in America. No, shoes? no, nothing. Like, kicked him into the streets, let him stay in a hostel for three days. And then oh. by the end of it, we're like, all right, you got your bearings, right? And then he killed himself. Yeah, and then he killed himself. He oh, did? Of yeah. course he did. Oh, yeah. no. He I, what, what else is he going to do? Tatumbe was here? <laughs> did, he, <laughs> yeah, did, did he carve that into the wood? <laughs> no, I think he put his real name. <laughs> Not the slave name Michael gave him. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the awful racially. Uh, just a series of racist <laughs> syllables <laughs> strung together, and then immediately the revelation in his eyes was evident of what have I done? Uh, <laughs> There's no coming back from this. Yeah, yeah. What have I done? <laughs> They're not going to have to split the check three ways that's, anymore. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> I would, I would like to say, I would, I would like a big, I would like a comp, I would like an L-shaped couch. Mm-hmm. I would like a uh, a fifty-five inch television. Fifty-five. Yeah, I don't need to be too big. I'm not, I'm not asking for too much. Oh, I'm going for a hundred. Yeah, I know, but you want too much, you know. So <laughs> I uh, give me, give me a a, a fire stick, uh, a PlayStation Four. I don't even need five. Give me a four, a couple games. And uh, and and some stuff to make margaritas. I'll I'll be in that I'll be in that exhibit for a year. Why not before. a five? You're 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 really compromising your prison sentence. If they're going to give you anything you want, why not a five? Because I want to still remember that I'm in a zoo, and because I want to have the ability <laughs> to strive to get out of it someday. Right. And oh. if I have a five, I'm like, well, living this is living yeah. easy. Here's the thing, man. I know you didn't have that answer before he asked you, but that was like That's world good. class. Yeah. Think on your feet. Yeah, that, was, yeah. Great. that yeah, was that was great. Outrageous. <laughs> yeah. Very proud of you. <laughs> While having just described a divorced man's apartment. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I have a car bed. It's yeah. very cool. <laughs> Pornos. Yeah. I got a PS4, so I know I'm still lonely. Yeah. Makes me go out and go on dates. <laughs> yeah. Um, I would get a jackhammer. Da, 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 da. Break and, my way out. <laughs> yeah, great answer. <laughs> Nothing wrong with that. I feel like that answer is cheating. Like any <laughs> any way to like 
In this hypothetical fake game? Yeah. 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 No, because once you get past the concrete, you're just in dirt, and jackhammering dirt will do nothing. It'll just pack it tighter. Yeah. Yeah. Really? I would get a bread maker so I can make my own bread. (laughs) (laughs) Okay. Sagalo sourdough. (laughs) <laughs> yes, oh, yes. <laughs> your saga dough. Not bad, saga dough. Oh, you had it. Okay. That's good. Yeah. yeah, leave a five star review. Let's get <laughs> out of the plug, shall we? Leave a five star review. Comment on iTunes. Share this with your friends. Subscribe to the YouTube. The numbers are bumping up. We're having guests. You guys are loving it. And uh, thank you for all the new listeners that we're getting week by week. Everything can be found at here's a scenario dot com. All of our social medias, links to the podcast, links to uh, YouTube, Patreon, etc. Again, if you want preferential treatment in terms of the questions that you ask, go to patreon.com slash scenario pod. All of that money goes directly into the show and into us to help support and make this show continue to happen. And uh, individually, we have plugs. Sam. Uh, you can just follow me at, at Sam Talent on Instagram, T-A-L-L-E-N-T. Uh, SamTalent.com has all my dates. Philadelphia Helium, uh, 419, 420 in Houston, and Secret Group, nice. 421 in Lafayette. Uh, just, you know, tell your friends. Watch my Don't Tell special. I just, just minutes. telling them I just watched it before. It's great. Oh, Excellent. sick. I saw it. the clips look awesome. Thanks, man. Yeah, you're, and you're good. killing outside. Yeah. 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 That's, that's fucking hard to do Thanks, and, and not evident in some of the other clips. Is that in... Uh... Well, they fixed a lot in post. <laughs> <laughs> not in mine. Uh-huh. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Mine was Natch. What? Is that in Los Angeles? <laughs> it was in Santa Barbara. Ah. Ah, yeah, which, near Los Angeles. Killer set though, so funny. The upside down seventy nine is just outstanding. Thank you. And uh, Brendan, what do you got? Uh, also follow me at Brendan Sagalo on Twitter and Instagram and TikTok and all that fun stuff. And uh, I got dates coming up. Uh, they're not secured yet, but keep a lookout. <laughs> BrendanSagalo dot com. Don't know why I said that. Uh, and you just want people to know you got. I'm cooking, work. baby. Hey, I want hey. you to know I'm trying. We all got perspective work out there. Just Someday as- it's gonna happen. <laughs> <laughs> so, so, <laughs> if you so want to see me, keep praying. Yeah. <laughs> um, and other than that, twitch.tv slash sags to riches, where I play a bunch of video games, sometimes with Feeny. Nice. Michael. Yeah, uh, I'll be in Boston and Seattle and Oregon and, and Portland uh, and uh, and then eventually later at the end of the year, uh, Colorado. So, uh, you know, go to MikeFeeneyComedy.com for dates, uh, sign up to get some emails sent to you. And also the three of us will be at the Algonquin Arts Theater. That's right, right during fucking South Jersey's Woodstock. So that'll be yeah. fun. Yeah, uh, yeah we're competing with the biggest music festival. Didn't know it. It's going to be great. September uh, get, 16th. Yeah, get Tickwits. Uh, tickwits. <laughs> They're at the AlgonquinArts.org. How'd they do tickets off the nip- market? <laughs> yeah. It kept causing natal prolapse. Good candy, but that died. Nicole. We, hold on. I didn't even plug, <laughs> but we just did a live episode in Emmaus. Thank you, everybody, that came out yes. that came out to that. It was super fun. The live show was awesome. You get a mix of our stand-up as well as the podcast. It's very interactive, and you guys get to join in. So, uh, yeah, come out to the Algonquin Theater in September. And then for 420, I'm doing my crowd work on edible shows again this time taking it up a notch we're doing two shows in a night one in Stamford, connecticut at new york comedy club nice. at 7 p.m and then the next one at new york comedy club gramercy at 10 30 p.m nicole's going to be along for the ride to to film it who's These driving guys, you guys? uh me <laughs> as fast as possible with my eyes closed no they uh they we have drivers and stuff uh, goober goober Goober. 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 Are you Goober. okay? Yeah, Goober no, and no, yeah. no, I'm, <laughs> I'm having a great day, though. I really am. I'm having a good time with my I family. feel good. I have a good energy. Yeah, me too, man. This is Let great. us decide that. But um, yeah, 420. Get those shows. It's going to be really fun. Dude. And then I'm going to be in Charlotte, North Carolina, <laughs> Seymour, Connecticut, Hollywood East, East Providence, Rhode Island at The Connection, and then, uh, you know, all over at MikeCannonComedy.com. Nicole, what do you got? Nicole C. Lines on Instagram. Chia, chia. Uh, and by the way, people are loving the expansion of the Nicole character on this podcast. Right. She had a very active part in last week's The Pranking, of, or two weeks ago at this point, The Pranking of Brendan Sagalow, which uh, is just an epic tale. And Nicole All really fucking episode. shined and stepped up to the plate to, yeah. yep. to pull the wool over this. It'll never side. be the same, our relationship, but I think <laughs> it's worth it, to be honest. Yeah, it's better for the show. Yeah. All right. Uh, next question. Cerna style. Here's a scenario pizza shop. You open a pizza shop. What's your signature pie? And what's the reason your restaurant ultimately fails? Uh, I would do eggplant and mozzarella. 
Nice. Yes, with uh, maybe a little kiss of Calabrian chili oil on there. Oh, real, real soft eggplant, almost baba ganoush, but with enough texture that it doesn't just get gloppy and sloppy. Real Ooh. crispy crust. Yeah. Oh my Easy. god. Easy. Damn. Yeah. That's maybe ricotta. Good. We'll see. Yeah, we'll see dude. what texture. I'm getting pizza after is this. Yeah. Uh, I'm fucking hungry, dude. <laughs> I haven't eaten shit today. Let's get food. I can't. I got to go do taste buds. <laughs> oh, uh, they'll yeah. provide you with more do food. They? Probably eat no, they'll just talk you to you that. about food. Yeah, and I'm yeah. drooling. Yeah. You're going to get yeah. hungrier. The roast is slowly turning into a piece of chicken. <laughs> 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 Tell him to bring some Sammies. I'm not going to boss to Rosa around. He's, <laughs> he was nice enough to have me. I'll text him. I'll be like, hey, Joe, Sam would never, but I'll ask. He's already in there. I would yeah. like to get a sandwich from his shop. I would too. Yeah. Well, what are you going to yeah. do? Yeah. I, know. Uh, <laughs> I don't remember what the question Oh, the pie. What kind of pizza? Yeah. Do you are you a vegetarian? No, at home I'm plant based. Yes. Okay. But on the road, <laughs> the tusks come in pretty quick. <laughs> Just rooting around. I know? hear you. Uh -huh. I hear you. Yeah. Plant based at home, huh? Yeah. Yeah. My wife went plant based and then I didn't want to cook two dinners. Sure. Mm -hmm. So now it's a lot easier. And also, it's cool. I feel better. <laughs> like, yeah, yeah. I yeah. want to put it all in her lap. I mean, sure. I will when I get home. Yeah, <laughs> like, tell me about it, right? right? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Wait, what? <laughs> what the heck? <laughs> Sagman. <laughs> Sagman, don't. <laughs> I like Sagman. <laughs> That's pretty cool. I like yeah. that, too. Yeah. 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 Sagman. Sagman, Sagman Carruthers. Mm -hmm. yeah. Oh, um, why, would you, why would the business fail, though? That's the second part. Oh, yeah. Oh. Just because nobody wants to eat that plant shit. Anyway, so what I'm gonna do? She's on it. <laughs> Sag man. <laughs> oh god. <laughs> you really disappointed him, man. Oh. oh god. All right, I gotta get him a gift. <laughs> <laughs> now he's sad, man. Yeah. <laughs> oh. What am I gonna do? That's right. I'll tell you what I'm gonna do. What's your signature pie? <laughs> Um, I don't want to make me laugh, but just somebody asking, what's your signature pie? Yeah. <laughs> um, so we all been to Burger King, haven't we? <laughs> okay. <laughs> so we've all been to Burger King, haven't we? Uh, uh -huh. How much all... time do you need to buy right now? <laughs> yeah, you don't have I'm to all... answer first. <laughs> I'm, I'm... Dude, Sam has picked up on Brendan Pretty so familiar. fast. How much time do you have to buy right now? Picked uh, up. He's not a uh, master how much, mind. How much are you selling? <laughs> yeah, but some people are so... <laughs> that's, that's fair, very He's fair. He's not Machiavellian in his intent. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I'm decoded. Some, well, I mean, I'm going to pretend to kill myself. Some people are so <laughs> nice, befuddled. Nice. I'm impressed actually yeah, by that. Oh yeah. Some people are so befuddled by him that they are unable to to make you know up from down. They yeah. can't do it. We've all got we've all got our fucking collars wrapped around the Rift Dog House. Yeah, you know? yeah, I get it. <laughs> yeah. Buying some time, right? And we just all gave you so, some more. So we all know Burger King. He has not spent one <laughs> now, moment. Do you think I'm thinking, thinking of the pie? <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm he was thinking about eating pizza <laughs> instead of oh, creating oh. his own pizza. No, I'm on keto still. Mike, what's yours? He's not gonna go. Well, let him give him time. All right, you're gonna. <laughs> you think, think I'm gonna it? think about it while he's talking? Yes. I'm a listener. All right. Well, I. You guys are all familiar with Wendy's. <laughs> <laughs> I like I where this is going. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, my favorite pies that I used to order from like from Domino's when they had the five 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 or whatever uh -huh. the five dollar medium. I would always extend it a buck and add a second uh, topping. But I love a fucking pie of well done pepperoni with yes. jalapeno. Okay. Those oh, two things, jalapeno. and I think whatever that uh, pepper oil yeah, you were saying, Calabri and chili oil. I mean, I'm fucking in. Anytime Feeney says something that's very foody, I want to hit that out of the park and just never consider it food in my entire life. But you sold me on it. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah it just was you saying the same thing. <laughs> yeah, that's right. Uh, yeah. Yeah. That's right. Yeah. Um, yeah. But it's very. It's clearly I have something with you. You've yeah. got a charm about we'll you. Talk about it. Feeney is. Um, <laughs> You know, we just don't like the guy. Yeah. <laughs> that, that came out too authentic. Yeah. Impressive. Don't bump it onto me, dude. You're the one that uh, that. Uh, <laughs> so we all know Burger King, right? <laughs> I do think I would honestly go with like a well done pepperoni with uh, the chili oil on yeah. top of it. That's right. and that is, uh, yeah. but there, I feel like there could be a nice there could be a way to offset that with some sort of a cool a cool other feature on it. You know, a cooling feature. To yeah, offset honey. The heat. 
Oh, uh, oh, hot honey. Oh, I mean, a, you know, oh, a Mike's hot honey, honey kind of a situation. Mike's hot honey. Maybe an external cold blue cheese dip with a Ew. side of sagalo no. dough. Turn no. off, turn off, Cannon's mic. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I really felt left out of the cold when you were like, oh, hot. <laughs> Bringing in a <laughs> fucking condiment to make the pizza edible. Ugh. Christ on the cross. Maybe that's yeah. why he goes out right. of business. Yeah, maybe. Maybe. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> or I launder. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I was going to say embezzlement for sure. Yeah. 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 I feel like there would be some sort of. Uh, you know, money thing, <laughs> yeah. money dispute. Yeah. There'd yeah. be some sort of money dispute. Getting, getting serious about it, <laughs> uh, our pie thing could never happen. Yeah, yeah, we named it Joe's Pizza, yeah. and turns out we had a pretty hefty lawsuit we could not yeah. overcome. <laughs> Shouldn't have named it American Pie, but damn, that's a good name for a pie place. <laughs> that is a good name. For that's a pie. pretty good. I wanted to blast. Welcome to yeah. my island, dude. Uh-huh. Step on in. Welcome to Sag Island. <laughs> Welcome to Sag Island. It's just Sag Harbor. Yeah, Sag over there Harbor. in Sag Harbor. Yeah. <laughs> Welcome to Sag Harbor. <laughs> That's my island. I love that. <laughs> I got so this is what I'm gonna do. Burger King. I'm yeah. serious about that. Okay. You know the Hershey's pie. Yeah. That. Let's put some Oreos in there instead. You're not punching him in the I'm face. I'm going to need right? your eyebrows to sound more hammered me about blue cheese. I'm going to need your eyebrows to look more interested because right now they're looking disappointed and no, it's making me lose They're confidence. quizzical. That's what they look like. Quizzical. Yeah. yeah. Okay. I'll give you, you that. Which is I... what Quibi stood for. Yeah. Oh, Will Smith. <laughs> um, okay. So uh, the Oreo pie. So a bit like the Hershey's pie, but it's Oreo. And instead of the bread on the side... It's going to be the Domino's sugar bread thing that they have, that the dipping. Oh. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So you're going full mm-hmm. dessert. It's pie. a full dessert pie. Signature. Signature That's pie. That's what you want them to mention when they say the name Brendan Sagalo. And it goes out of business well, because. Of that pie. Yeah. Because yeah. yeah. every cause it, No returning customer. Yeah. 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 No, it goes out of business because I get like foundered. You know what I mean? Like some guy comes in and like takes my whole business from me and makes it like McDonald's or something. It makes oh, it better yeah, yeah. on it every level. Streamlines yeah. the business, makes mm-hmm. yeah. pies. Yeah. Just takes the name American Pie or whatever it's it is. It's a good name. Yeah. Yeah. If, yeah that's what if it's Don it. Henley who comes in and scoops it up? Hey, he yeah. can have it. Yeah. Look, I, I did my part. Yeah, for a price. <laughs> Very good. <laughs> Look, I did my part. I ripped off the name. I came up with a terrible pie. I've done my job. <laughs> I yeah. took Hershey's. Yeah. I took Oreo. I smushed them together. Yeah. yeah, I'm the first guy that runs off, and then I'm passing the baton to you. But you, you would never get that baton if I didn't run off. You even took when Feeney said, I've done my part. <laughs> Uh, that's a yes and. That's just a yes. Uh, oh, also watch the video of Sagalo oh, yeah. and Sagalo's YouTube of us, of us riffing in uh, in Michigan. Or Grand riffing Rapids. in Michigan. That ah, changed the title yeah, now. Man, Hurry, I have to it up. It now. Uh, uh, what is but it called? Improv. Mike Feeney and Brendan yeah. Sagalo on Live stage in... together talking into microphones. It's nice. <laughs> You know, I didn't have to write Mike Feeney. <laughs> I could have edited you out completely. Isn't that right, Mike? <laughs> it just does a, it's a swarm like a swarm of bees. There's, oh, it sure is, Mike. <laughs> there's one of the greatest no buts of all time that happened where I go, Brendan has sex like uh, Winnie the Pooh with did take the shirt off. And he went, no, but. <laughs> and then and then, the, and then I kept going with but it. But then I yes and you. Yeah, he joined in I once joined the audience was like clapping, yeah. you know. Uh, <laughs> they were having a good time. And then he's like, this Ew. is my joke. <laughs> this <Well>. is my <laughs> job. It's just fun to see a dynamic live. You know? <laughs> <laughs> to see the see us live at yeah. the Algonquin Theater. Seeing the tears in the seams is fun. <laughs> <laughs> oh, we are, we are all an old it's pair all of seams. underwear. We are all patches. <laughs> yeah, yeah dude. But we're an old yeah. pair of underwear that you can't throw out because, goddamn it. They're comfortable. They yeah. The- and your dead mom gave them to you. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Uh-huh. <laughs> Whenever yeah. you put them on, you think about her. To throw away them would be to throw her away. Yeah. That's right. All right. Next question. Brandon, is there a movie or a song that yes. you associate with your sexual history? Ooh. For example, the first time I had period sex, <sighs> the Greg Kinnear smash hit, Stuck on You was playing ah. in the background. I like that movie. That's the Conjoined Twins Yeah, one. with Matt Damon. Yeah. I would say he's probably ahead of Greg Kinnear in the cast. Uh-huh. Yeah, it's a, it's a Matt Damon vehicle. Yeah. yeah. 
Uh, I would. I know I that think Greg Kinnear was literally Matt Damon's vehicle in that. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> that was like the beginning of the end for the Farrelly brothers. Too. Yeah. I mean, I think they've they're starting to kind of rebound or whatever. But that uh, th- yeah, in terms of their off. hot their hot streak of movies, mm-hmm. kind of abruptly, they were so upset they couldn't do White Chicks. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> <laughs> we had that script for years. <laughs> Everyone said we were crazy. <laughs> I I think I remember seeing the movie White Noise with Michael Keaton. I believe it was. Mm-hmm. Oh yeah, uh, post movie, right? Yeah, yeah, where you could like you can hear him through the white noise of the yeah. radio or something like that. Oh yeah, I had uh, I I don't I, I was gonna say I had uh, fucked around with a girl. I don't know what you say. We I hooked th- up, hooked up with right? a girl in the theater. Started during pressing that. your penis. Yeah, there was some pants. It was some digits. Oh, there was some tongues. Nice dude. There was some. Um, Schmacking at the lips. There we go. First time <laughs> oh, I. Yeah. Uh, Who's this guy? <laughs> <laughs> Where's he been? Hey. <laughs> Talk to me about white noise and watch me go. Yeah. Wind me up. Hey, Speaking hey. of white noise. My name's Jimmy Eyebrows. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> white noise had me and my friends sitting around like a radio and a TV listening to white noise and asking it questions like a bunch of fucking idiots. <laughs> oh, yeah. Yeah, it was a bad movie. That's. Are you in here? <laughs> <laughs> That's the most embarrassing anecdote you've ever shared on this show. <laughs> and I read my fucking uh, uh, poetry or something, whatever that was. Whoa, nice. <laughs> That's good. That's brave. Yeah. Yeah, we do a lot of brave stuff. He, he wrote a me. song. He wrote a breakup song for his high school girlfriend. And we, we read it on the oh, show. Yeah. And it's, That's good content. It's unbelievable. Oh, it's best. Yeah, yeah. We actually should just, that was a Patreon episode. Yeah, we should release we that. We should just release that. Yeah, since you quit putting them out. <laughs> 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 Are you, you know, Cerna style? You know, my podcast, Chubby Behemoth, we have another episode. What is it? Chubby Behemoth. Oh, you didn't plug yeah. that at all. Well, I wanted it. to put it in organically. <laughs> <laughs> you get more ears on it when you slip it in during the actual show. Chubby yeah. b- b- Behemoth. Is it just you? No, it's Nathan Lund. Of course. Yeah, Love another, another fat guy. <laughs> yeah. uh, here's mine. Bicentennial Man. Oh, oh yeah. Remember Robin this? Williams? Robin Williams. Wow. Mm-hmm. It, went, it was a boy-girl birthday party. We attended it. And all my friends broke up with their, they, they sectioned off with girls throughout the theater. And I was left with total babe, Nikki Patterson. Nikki. Nice. And she was sitting in the seat in front of me. And I did the thing where you like step over the seat. And I sat down right beside her Ooh. with my arm up. And as soon as I sat down, she got up and moved to the row in front of me oh. again. <laughs> so there was about three of these exchanges where I was like, okay, Nikki, very funny. And kept doing it. And the third time she said, stop following me very loud. Whoa. Yes. So that was, that was one for me. <laughs> mm-hmm. I'll never forget just how dejected and othered I felt during yeah. Bicentennial Man. And then you Man. just had to watch <laughs> Bicentennial Man, which may be the worst punishment yes. of all. Yes. While smelling her hair from behind. Yes. <laughs> Mm-hmm. That was very bad. <laughs> Your mindset is like, maybe I'll do this all the way to the front. She yeah. nowhere to she go. can't leave. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Can't move. Make, in worst case scenario, I got her looking straight up. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> do you know what's funny? I have two things. I, I so I have the city Washington DC uh-huh. and the band um Bare Naked Ladies uh-huh. are that for me. Uh-huh. Because eighth grade trip, we went to Washington DC. Oh, yeah. I was dating my now wife. Tell me about and we that. broke up because I held her in a way that was embarrassing. What'd you do uh, behind From the higher back ankles? Yeah. The belly? Prom- yeah, yeah. Prom yeah. pose? Yes. The mm-hmm. behind the back it was I was really big into that because I was watching a lot of Dawson's Creek at the oh, time. Nice. And it felt and I felt like that's how fifteen year olds show affection. That is intimate. And um, yeah, and it got really made fun of by the whole school. Mm. And uh, she broke up with me on the trip. And then Bare Naked Ladies was the next year when I was redating my wife. And we were both non drinking, not straight edges with the X's on our hands, but just non drinking. Just and, squares. Yeah. 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 Uh, athletes. Mm-hmm. Athlete squares. Sure. Yeah. Yeah. Yes, Lame square. as hell. Lame as fuck. Losers. Right. Yes. Yeah. yeah. Um, Lacking the physical ability to make it all the way, but not knowing that as of yet. Yeah. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Who would? <laughs> so <laughs> you never she, know until you try, Mike. Yeah, yeah. yeah. reach yeah. for the stars, Feeny. Happy birthday, bitch. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> so my uh, my 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 girlfriend at the time <laughs> really, really threw you off. Yeah, yeah really hurt. there's a vein in your eyebrow that is 
<laughs> yeah, bulging. Uh, it's, uh, it's own heartbeat. <laughs> when anybody talks about my past uh, sports career with anything but reverence, I, <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I got a pain in my head. But uh, yeah, my we were we were. I guess she she wasn't as into it as I was. The not drinking. I was into it for family reasons. My dad was an alcoholic, had the whole problem. All of my family, all that shit, and she just kind of came along for the ride. Then she went to a concert in ninth grade with all the older girls on her basketball team Uh and drank two beers. Shit. That son of a bitch. And I dumped her for lying to me about it. How'd you find out? Uh, I found out because uh, one of her friends had like said like you know in front of me we had such a great time at the bare naked ladies concert yeah. you got so drunk ha 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 or whatever and How i was old? like and How i re- old? we were in ninth grade and my heart sunk and yeah. i was like livid and just so fucking cynically catholic yeah. and uh broke up with her on the spot whoa you're like yeah. it's been one second can you believe the different iterations of me my wife has witnessed and still is like yeah long that's for the ride that's nuts she's pot committed yeah, what was yeah. that 30 years ago um, what's ninth grade? You're 14? Yeah. So 24. 35 years ago, 24. Yeah. <laughs> 35. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, and I said this on the, the podcast before, but I, uh, Shania Twain's Man, I Feel Like a Woman. Oh, that song rules. That, yeah. Well, that song has an association with me bow, because of the bow, girl that bow, I, bow, I broke bow, up bow, with. Bow. This girl and I broke up and it didn't end well. And then she hacked into my voicemail and made my outgoing message the damn, I feel like a woman song. Yeah. So it was like, so anytime that someone called me, it was, it was. That's know. awesome. I would be like, thank you for that unique thing. That but that was back in the day when <laughs> everybody's voicemail was a song. Right, yeah. And it wasn't always like a, it was like recorded off the yeah. phone yes. for speakers. So it's like way too yeah. loud and call. Break me up, break <laughs> me up <laughs> yeah. Hi, this is Mike. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. Turn that down. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> How did she hack you know, into your voicemail? What? She just guessed my password. Yeah, yeah. Um, because she at the time, she, you know, she knew what it was. My buddy Justin went to jail once, and he left an outgoing voicemail message that was like, "Hey, this is Justin, and uh, I'm going on vacation for three to five weeks." Everyone, <laughs> anyway, <laughs> leave a message. I'll get back to you. And me and my buddy Bonzo just hacked it and was like, "Hi, this is Justin. I'm in jail for rape." <laughs> <laughs> and he wasn't in jail for rape, but <laughs> so yeah, we left that up there for like five weeks. Or well, that's the thing, dude. You never, you, <laughs> you never hear your own voicemail. Know. You know, because like even if you would call your own phone, you would just go straight to <laughs> the, the like, yeah. please enter your password. So you would never hear it unless someone else was like. Hey man, your voicemail? Like <laughs> yeah, they like that they is would have to diabolical. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> one that. of the prisoners calls like one of the I, I've been I've been put away for rape and then he, they kill him. <laughs> right. Something. Yes. I don't know. Yeah. One time it was, when it was I was one younger, of the worst things I've done. When I was when I was younger, me and my buddy Luke's uh voice like numbers. Was there got, multiple got, guys named Luke? Or was it one buddy I, named Luke? I was also, but then if you listened for a half a second more, there was one guy named it Luke. Yeah. yeah, if you if you just listened for a half a <laughs> but second more, right but I'm... now I'm more interested that there was a guy named Luke's. <laughs> it's a good name. It, it was his real name. Is it on It was just Luke. Oh, but our numbers got mixed <laughs> up for some reason. So when people tried to call him, they would call me, and my voicemail was this like joke that I heard that was like. Uh, I'm, I, and this was when I was doing comedy. So it was like, I may be on stage or having sex. So I'll call you back in 45 minutes or two seconds. Yeah. And he got, uh, it's not bad, not bad, but it's stolen. It was a, it was, oh. uh, I think a Doug Benson <laughs> joke. Oh, and, uh, <laughs> but it was like, I had just started in comedy. Give me some, I was just a kid, As man. To I was just a when fucking you discovered kid, you man. Streeter Seidel joke. For I was just, yeah, but I didn't like steal <laughs> streeters. I'm just a he hack. He absorbed it. I'm just a hack. So, <laughs> my buddy Luke got a DUI, but it wasn't his first. <laughs> wasn't his first DUI. Why did you do that like you were an up close magician? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Nothing under what my body. What a Queens DUI. is red. <laughs> um, and his parole officer called me, and she goes, "Interesting message, Luke." And I still have it. I still have it on my phone. Oh, wow. If you'd like to hear it, yes, I would. Does it go past? Boy. <laughs> I'm getting caught that? cheating. What? <laughs> cheating? I meant lying. Jeez. Oh, something's something, something. That's a little Freudian, Freudian slip. That's right. Come on over there, Brendan's stepping out on his girlfriend. Clearly, no. Oh, hey. <laughs> stepping out. You have been with your wife for fifty. Years. Oh yeah, oh, yeah. <laughs> fifty-five years. He's stepping, stepping out, out on that dame. Yeah. <laughs> so this is the message I got from somebody who's calling about my friend. Either he's going to jail or not. Yeah. 
Come on, you son of a bitch. Wait. I love it if you accidentally deleted it right I now. I just call her back. Hold on, fuck. God damn it. It's never worked. This is unbelievable. <laughs> I've been in this position. It's the... Uh, here we Hi, go. This is for Luke. Um, interesting message you've got there, Luke. Two more. And 419. Oh, God. No. <laughs> <laughs> I think it's still going. Anyway. Interesting message you got there, Luke. Yeah. Well, story didn't pay off at all. No. And okay. that's the show, everybody. That's hey. how no, we're wow. using it. Oh, on wow. that. We, yeah. on that. we absolutely on. have to sputter out to a meaningless ending. It's like when they put in the special needs kid at the end of the game to score a touchdown and he just eats the ball. Yeah. <laughs> He's just <laughs> chewing on it. Yeah. yeah, that's what they don't show on Sports Center. <laughs> yeah. He very rarely <laughs> runs to the other end zone. <laughs> here's Igby Carlisle, and they're putting him in for the ceremonial score. And and he is, and he is fucking the ball. Oh no! Everyone, please hide your children. <laughs> yeah, cover those eyes at home. You stuff. may want to head to the parking lot. <laughs> Igby Carlisle is that's a, that's a good top special tier. needs name. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, that's gonna be my uh, name when I go to hotels now. Yeah. Oh, it's gotta be. Thank you, everybody, so much. Again, scenario. Uh, here's the scenario. dot com and uh, scenario pod on Patreon. Follow Sam Talent. Follow Sam. Thanks Talent. for having me, guys. We love you, convoy. Yeah.